Hi everyone, it's Veronica and I wanted to share with you my project for the embellishment box swap that's being hosted by Scrap the World. We had to um, use the boxes that you find at Dollar Tree, the little compartment boxes, and we had to fill each compartment with embellishments. There was no specific theme, but you weren't to just throw embellishments in there all willy-nilly. You need to have some kind of coordination about it. Um, and I chose Shabby. Uh, there are four of us in the group, and we had to make at least three of the embellishments that went in the box. This is how my embellishments are packaged. And I just took glassine bags and um, added some modeling paste with a stencil. The uh, I just tied it with tulle and I added this uh, bauble. This is the Cat Scrappiness nesting tag and I used thickers, the glitter thickers, uh, for the initials for each person in my group. So it's very simple packaging. Um, and what I'm going to do is slide these over, sorry for the noise, so that you can see my box. And this is how mine turned out, which I thought was really kind of cute. I used Wild Orchid Crafts flowers. Um, this piece here was from the wedding section at Hobby Lobby. This flower also was from that section. There was trims from my stash, and these trims were from Hobby Lobby. Um, I also added pearl trim here, and that pink trim I added all around the box as well. I also added feet, the little uh, plugs. I just painted those pink and added that at the bottom because the trim had a little overhang, so I kind of wanted it to not squish when it was on the you know on your table or desk or whatever so that is how i decorated the outside of the box oh and this is some other trim that i had in my stash as well so i put it here and here all right so let us look at the contents Now, what I'm going to share with you first are the three embellishments that I made. I did an altered key. Hadn't done one of those in forever. So these keys were not white. I had to paint those. I added a Wild Orchid Crafts flower here and added some, um, uh, oh my goodness, stickles. Stickles. And some uh, Want to Scrap Bling here. And that's just the back side. So that is one. I also did a dangle. I used a heart and some pale pink pearls and just added a clasp and also the uh, spacer beads here. And the last one that I created was a bottle cap. Again, something that I have not done in a very long while. Just added a bow. This is the um, the paper that I put inside here is botanical tea, since I had been working with that paper. The bottle caps were already flattened, already had the hole in it, so that made it easy for me. And I used uh, glitter paper, just cut a scallop and put that on the back side. These uh, flowers are, they are beads from Michael's. There are two that are this color, and then there's uh, the other two are uh, turquoise. Okay. And um, I just added different little things. Here we have clothespins, the little miniature clothespins. They're all white except one, and it's pink. Um, here, wood veneers metal pieces, some of my favorite sequin bows, 
lots of beads and um, seed beads here. Here I added a metal butterfly. I hope y'all are seeing this. And then I punched out butterflies in those colors using the Martha Stewart punches. I have clips here. Bind, small binder clips and the paper clips. This one I added um, oh gosh <laughs> what are these called? Um, oh you know what they're called. I'm sorry. <laughs> I had drawn a blank on that one. My goodness. Okay. And some ribbon buckles and also some brads. Okay, here, this compartment has beads in it, but they're flowers. Thought that was really cute. And then this one, cabochon one. Okay. And then here are a lot of flowers. Different little flowers here. And in the last one, uh, bling trim and with this one you know you can take your markers and color the beads any color you wish and then customarily we um, always add little uh, an extra little goodie and I'm thinking okay what can that be because everything in the box is a goodie so what I decided to do was to cut some um, bag toppers, little small bag toppers, and also some bows. And that is the goodie that's included for each person in my group. And honestly, when I first got this, I really thought that it was a butterfly. It can pass for one, but they're actually bows. So I thought those turned out real cute. The top, this butterfly is glittered. Um, and I think that's the only glittered piece that I have there. And then uh, the topper. And actually, um, this closes at the bottom. So you could probably use the packaging again. I just put repositional glue dots on it so that um, they will easily come off. And then on the back side is my information about the swap. All right. Thank you all for watching. And happy crafting.